welcome welcome back to my channel today we are making cold press coconut oil great for your skin for your hair and even for cooking it is loaded with vitamins and minerals guys this coconut oil was derived from seven medium coconuts keep watching as i show you the recipe please do not forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel also hit the post notification bell so you get notified each time i upload a new video thank you So let's get to work, guys. So, guys, I'll be using this little coconut hammer which i got from the supermarket going to crack open the coconut discard the water then you will see how the process goes okay keep watching guys so you want to make sure you go for matured coconuts very mature coconuts will give you maximum amount of oil if you buy coconuts which are not matured you won't derive much oil from those, okay? Yes, so... I want to make sure your coconut has water in it. Okay. You can see how matured our coconut looks. So, this is the seven coconut. It's been shredded. But as you all can see, it's not fine. So, I'm going to pass this like maybe one more time using my, my blender. While blending it, you want to use lukewarm water. Do not put too much water, just enough to blend the coconut. This is the coconut, I've blended it. Now I am going to extract the coconut milk from the coconut So, I did add warm water again after squeezing out milk from the first batch. I did it. This is the second time I am squeezing it. And it will be the final squeeze for extracting the milk from the coconut. After this, now I'm going to use my cheesecloth to give it the final sieve. So this is my cheese clutch, the one that I'm using. 
if you don't have something like this you can go ahead and use your kitchen towel okay i just want to give the coconut milk a stir then i will go ahead and sieve it into my cheesecloth i just want to make sure that there is no coconut chaff inside my coconut milk when it is finally ready so you can see i've got some coconut chaffs okay i'll we'll just keep this aside now that i am 100 percent sure that what I have here is just pure coconut milk but guys remember that there is coconut milk here mixed with water okay so for us to for us to extract the water we are going to leave this coconut milk to sit for some hours so you can you can leave it to sit on your countertop until the water separates from the milk but I'm going to show you a little trick that I use. So I'm going to be using this plastic bag to separate my milk from the water. Okay, so what I do is I'm going to pour my coconut milk in this plastic bag. Okay, I'm going to pour everything in here. Oops, sorry about that. Just pouring everything there in the bag. So here is the milk in the bag. I'm just going to tie this and I'm going to hang it to separate. But you want to make sure to, to let this sharp angle be facing downwards so that your milk can separate properly from the water and you want to also leave a space okay so yes yeah, something like this something like this yeah like this it's fine Going to hang it here, so I will leave it here. Mm -hmm. You can see it has separated very well. So now we're going to extract the water. That are separated from the milk so at this point you want to be very vigilant okay immediately you cut it here and the water comes out you have to be very vigilant so that the milk does not follow So guys, here is our coconut milk, you can see, and here is the water, we are going to discard that, it is just water, okay. So guys, here is our coconut milk, as you can see, it is pure coconut milk now. At this stage, 
you can either use it to make your virgin coconut oil or your cold pressed coconut oil by virgin coconut oil i mean the method whereby you can put this in a pot and apply heat cook this on a low flame until the milk starts releasing coconut oil another method which i mentioned is the cold pressed which is my preferred method this method you can just cover this up and leave it in a warm area in your house okay until the coconut milk ferments and the oil separates itself from the coconut milk which is called the curd okay since it's winter time now in south africa and we do not have a lot of heat inside the house guys i'm going to put this coconut milk in plastic bags and i will keep them in a warm area in the house just to facilitate its fermentation process okay if it is your first time visiting my channel you are most welcome please do not forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel when you subscribe kindly hit the post notification bell so you get notified each time i upload a new video thank you Coconut milk will ferment faster when stored in a warm environment, okay? So that's why you see me tying it in plastic bags. Okay, guys, keep watching and I will show you the next step. So, guys, it's been, it's been here overnight, okay? So let's see what's been going on. Remember I told you people about the fermentation process and also how that I wanted the coconut milk to ferment, okay, and separate. So let's see what's going on here. In case there is any water, it will also separate from the curd. Okay. Go. So guys, you can see the fermentation has taken place. There's water underneath and there is the curd, which is the milk and the oil. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to remove this topper part, which is what is of interest to us. We're going to discard the water. So in here is the milk and the oil, but you cannot achieve this without allowing it to ferment for at least a day, okay? So here is just water, we're going to discard that. If you check inside in between here, I don't know if you can see clearly, that is the oil, even here, 
this is oil okay but then we'll have to melt it so i will cover it and let it sit next to my window for some few hours then i will come back to show you people the outcome so i decided to just leave it outside under the sun i'll leave it here for about one or two hours and then we'll come back to see what happened so let's see yeah it's been here now for about an hour you can see the oil see the oil you can see so i will just leave it to 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 continue melting so guys you can see our oil you can see our oil now all what you see here is oil okay so now what we are going to do we're going to we're going to scoop we're going to scoop this let me do like this we're going to scoop this oil out we're going to be using our cheese cloth okay and we're going to scoop the oil out this is coconut oil so now this is cold pressed coconut oil okay this is cold press coconut oil So you want to make sure to sieve as much oil as possible, discard the rest. Then when you store it into the fridge, this liquid will harden and it will become more white in color. So now you see how much oil we got from seven medium coconuts. If you loved what you just watched, please consider liking commenting and subscribing to my channel and also do not forget to hit the post notification bell so you get notified each time i upload a new video please share 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 this video to as many people as possible thank you for watching until next time when i come again with another recipe stay healthy stay safe bye bye